15 years is a really long time. The story was shocking and infuriating, but I also knew it wasn't the only one. There's my handprint, a scratch on my thigh where my pants were cut open. They never believed me at any point in it. Law enforcement is allowing rapists to remain free because of inaction. That is the message coming from a federal lawsuit. Nationally, fewer than 1% of reported cases result in a felony conviction. At the end of the day, it doesn't matter what laws you make if no one enforces them. The only laws they're not enforcing are the ones that impact female victims of rape. It's not about me. It's about something much bigger. The decisions you make in this room change people's lives forever. I know this, my husband knows this, and my kids know this all too well. I can't use my real name because my rapist is still free. You have a security bar on this one? Yeah, I have a security bar on both. been fighting this for so long and it feels like everything I do is not enough. Do you give up or do you double down? So to summarize, it's basically attack on all fronts. Cool. Council members, it's beginning to feel like the plan is to break us, but we aren't going anywhere. Yes. This is our lives. Like, we've invested so much into this lawsuit. It is important to understand that this is the beginning there's an army of women that are really here trying to fight for change.